chest pain different causes chest pain can stem from many health issues some are quite serious while others may be nothing to worry about sometimes chest pain indicates a blocked artery and a heart attack this is an emergency situation in which the heart is not receiving enough blood and oxygen to function correctly however Chest pain can also stem from a health issue affecting the lungs, stomach or muscles for example. It is crucial to receive emergency care for chest pain, especially if it is sudden and severe and accompanied by shortness of breath, dizziness or both. Heart related causes. Many heart conditions can cause chest pain including heart attack. A heart attack may be the best known cause of chest pain and the pain usually occurs in the center of the chest. People experience this pain differently. Some describe it as uncomfortable, sharp, sudden and severe, while others report a squeezing sensation. In some people the pain comes and goes. It is worth nothing that a heart attack does not always cause chest pain. A person may experience other symptoms with or without chest pain including cold sweats, lightheadedness, nausea, pain in other areas such as the arms, back, jaw or stomach, shortness of breath, dizziness, sweating. Also males and females may experience heart attacks differently. Anyone who believes that they may be having a heart attack should receive immediate medical attention. Aortic dissection. This cause of chest pain is a life-threatening condition in which a tear forms in the lining of the aorta, one of the body's most important arteries. If the tear is large enough or a doctor cannot treat it in time, it can cause fatal bleeding. The symptoms are similar to those of a heart attack and they may also include leg pain or paralysis, paralysis on one side of the body, difficulty speaking or seeing. Anyone who may be experiencing this should receive immediate medical care. Pericarditis Pericarditis occurs when the sac that surrounds the heart called the pericardium becomes inflamed. This can cause chest pain, especially when a person takes a deep breath. Aortic stenosis. The aortic valve allows oxygenated blood to flow out of the heart's left ventricle and into the rest of the body. Stenosis occurs when this valve becomes stiff, either from age or disease. When this happens and the heart pumps out less blood, it can cause chest pain. Hypertrophic cardiomyopathy. This condition causes the heart's muscle to become overly thick, shrinking the heart's chambers. As a result, the heart is able to hold less blood and cannot pump as effectively. Hypertrophic cardiomyopathy can also prevent the heart from keeping a healthy electrical rhythm. Chronic obstructive pulmonary disease or COPD is an umbrella term for emphysema and chronic bronchitis. People with COPD often have pain in the upper middle chest as well as lung inflammation, frequent coughing and airway swelling. They may also experience costo costochondritis, inflammation of the muscles between the ribs. This can cause discomfort and stabbing, burning or aching chest pain. People without COPD can also develop costochondritis, triggered by a viral illness, for example. Lung infections Upper or lower respiratory infections as well as pneumonia can lead to chest pain. This is especially likely if a person is frequently coughing, which can tear and irritate the chest muscles. Pulmonary embolism. 
This refers to a clot that blocks the flow of blood in the lungs. It is a medical emergency that can be life-threatening. Symptoms of a pulmonary embolism include shortness of breath, anxiety, dizziness, and coughing. Digestive causes The following health issues affecting the stomach or esophagus. A thin tube that connects the mouth to the stomach can lead to chest pain. Esoph esophageal, esophageal spasm This refers to the esophagus contracting and relaxing rapidly. The result can be severe chest pain and discomfort, among other symptoms. The causes of these spasms are unclear, but stress and dietary and environmental, environmental factors may play a role. Gastroesophageal reflux disease or GERD is a chronic condition that causes stomach acid to rise into the esophagus and mouth. This can cause a burning sensation in the chest so severe that it resembles the pain of a heart attack. Nutcracker esophagus. This condition also called jackhammer esophagus can cause esophageal spasms and foot to rise back up into the esophagus, an issue called achalasia. Other health issues that affect the esophagus can also lead to chest pain. This includes ulcers and inflammation, such as the inflammatory condition eosinophilic esophagitis. Causes related to muscles or bones. Chest pain sometimes stems from a pulled chest muscle or inflammation of these muscles and the symptoms can be so severe that they resemble those of a heart attack. A person might experience numbness, sharp shooting pain that extends to the back and neck, tingling. Also, a broken or sprained rib can also lead to chest pain. Causes related to mental health Sometimes, extreme anxiety and other mental health issues cause chest pain. A person may, for example, be experiencing a panic attack, which can also cause the heart to pound loudly, heart palpitations, a rapid heart rate, shaking, shortness of breath, sweating, lightheadedness or dizziness, nausea. Another cause of chest pain that relates to the emotions is Takotsubo cardiomyopathy. This occurs when an extremely stressful experience causes temporary changes in the heart. Doctors also call this condition broken heart syndrome and the symptoms can mimic those of, of a heart attack. When to see a doctor? A person should receive immediate medical attention for chest pain even if the cause does not turn out to be a heart condition. It is especially important to receive urgent care if any of the following accompany chest pain, confusion, dizziness, nausea, shortness of breath, weakness, numbness. If a person recognizes the cause of their chest pain such as acid reflux or COPD, they should contact with their doctor if the symptoms worsen.